Today we are opening another package that I have no idea what is inside. What's up guys, we're back with another epic opening, but first we do have a quick giveaway. I'll be giving away these three cards. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, and let me know what you think is in the package. I have no idea. I know it's from the Yu-Gi-Oh! Rookie, but he didn't tell me what's inside, so let's get into it. This package is very tall, as you guys can see, so I'm going to be cutting this open off camera. There are multiple things in this box, as you expect such a large box. There is a bubble mailer, which I think there's something inside even though it's open. Uh, this thing, whatever you call that. There's a playmat. Let's check this thing out. We have a Storm of Ragnarok playmat. That's pretty sweet. Is that a hint what we'll be opening? I'm guessing Storm of Ragnarok Special Edition. And finally, we have a very Special Edition sized bag here. So if you guys missed the last time Yu-Gi-Oh! Rookie sent us something, he sent us a special edition for Generation Force. He told me this time it would be better, and next time it's going to be even better. So I'm expecting similar with the special edition. He sent us a Stormer Ragnarok mat. Seems like there's a good chance we get a Stormer Ragnarok special edition box. We'll see, though. This feels like it could be another special edition. Oh, there's the, there's the Stormer Ragnarok. Okay, maybe the other one's not Stormer Ragnarok. And there's another card in here. We have a... Odin, Father of the Aesir, Ultra Rare. So we could pull one of those in this video as well. That would be pretty crazy. All right, let's see what's in the bubble mailer. Don't forget to check out Yu-Gi-Oh! Rookie's channel. He sent these over so that you guys could go check out his channel. He will be doing a giveaway. What is this? Is this a giveaway? Or is it? I'm not sure what this is. Is there a note in here? Okay, there is a note. Let's find the note first. Okay, let's see what Yu-Gi-Oh! Rookie said. Okay, it's spooky season, so hopefully we'll catch a ghost on camera. It's about time. This set is one of my favorites, and I hope you like it as well. I got you something you could use as a field center for your Blue Eyes deck, as well as a couple other cool cards. Very nice. The Blue Eyes deck could use a field center. The mat, as well as the contents inside the black package, are for the giveaway. Okay, the mat is for the giveaway. What was the black package? Wait, this is the black package. You guys have a chance to win this Storm of Ragnarok special edition. Don't pull anything too crazy. Wait, you don't want us to pull anything crazy? I'm confused. Let's save our luck for December. All right, okay. December sounds promising. I see what you did there okay you want it to save the luck for december to the viewers hey guys if you want a chance at other cool giveaways give me a sub his name is Yu-Gi-Oh rookie on youtube i'll be giving away something similar with cosmo blazer generation force and the new challengers as well booster boxes tens etc yours truly Yu -Gi -Oh! rookie open your gift first i might have done this out of order <laughs> Uh, so what about these? He never said these. I think these are part of the giveaway, right? So there's a cyber barrier dragon. I'm, I'm just going to assume these are giveaway. A set of magnet warriors. That's really cool. And then of course the blue eyes, white dragon GX. It's like a Pokemon card, but it's blue eyes. And then the Odin. So I think all of those are giveaway. I think all these are giveaway. Yu-Gi-Oh! Rookie can clarify. And finally, we see what we will be opening today. A storm of Ragnarok special edition box. Okay. This is going to be a crazy opening because inside this, you can pull the Ghost Rare Odin, you can pull Max C Secret Rare, you can pull Ultimate Rare Odin, Ultra Rare Odin. There's a lot of really cool cards in here, including the other ones like Loki and Thor. All right, we have this opened. I'm going to do the classic when you have these special editions. I'm going to open up all the boxes off camera because it takes forever to open these. After 10,000 years, we've gotten everything open. Okay, not really that long, but it definitely felt like it took forever. We have a Light and Darkness Dragon. So here are all the 10 promos. Two Light and Darkness. We got a Hand of the Six Samurai, another Light and Darkness, another Light and Darkness. Okay, so we're at four to three, five to three, and six Light and Darkness versus four Hand of the Six Samurai. I think the Light and Darkness is probably better, so that's a good start. We have done a special edition opening of Storm of Ragnarok twice before. Once was for Josh, and the man got absolutely insane pulls. The next time, I don't remember if I bought it or if somebody else did, but... It wasn't the best pull. So we, one time we've had great pulls. The second time we didn't do so good. The nice thing about these Elemental Hero Ice Edge. Right off the bat we have a Super Rare. The nice thing about these is there's no ratios because it's just a bunch of random packs thrown in there. Someone sent me a picture that they apparently pulled two Ghost Rares out of theirs and a Maxi. I'm down for that. Let's keep going. I'm feeling a little better today, which is nice. Um, actually a lot better, but still somewhat of a itch in my throat. Uh, feeling a little bit... Uh, hot you know what i'm saying so uh hopefully today will be the end of it okay we've got a nordic relic all right scrap shark because i want to get back to streaming on twitch and i want to do you know be able to actually do stuff because when i felt sick was awful i couldn't do anything i was just sleeping for half the day which is never fun because you can't really get much done when you're asleep <laughs> tyrant's tire we got the shein squire we got the god of Demerol. Mimir of the Nordic Ascendant. A scrap Worm. We got a six strike triple impact. Okay. So far, we have pulled one super rare. There are 30 total packs in here. So we've got a lot of chances here. Anything can happen. I have still never pulled the Odin Ghost Rare. I've said this many a time. So I would be. There's a Ruxin special. I would be down to do it now. So let's see. Okay. Diverg. Let's see if Yu Gi Oh! Rookie sent us the hot box. Okay. So I'm guessing in December he's going to send something big because he was talking about, you know, don't. Don't use all the luck yet and all that stuff. So let's let's see if we can uh, 
I mean, at least pull one ghost rare, you know? That's not too crazy. Ooh! Legendary Six Samurai Shein. This is a very nice one. All right, Legendary Six Samurai. I know it's worth a few bucks. It's not crazy. This, I think, can come in Ultimate Rare, which would be a very nice pull. That's a good Ultra Rare to start it off with. There's the Shinang. Also, I think this is coming out the day after the Synchro Storm video. I think I'll be able to get them tomorrow and make the video in the same day uh, because it's, you know, coming out this week. We got the Worm King. Very nice. Uh, which is the beginning of three straight weeks of new sets, which is absolutely wild. I don't know why they did that. I know it had a lot to do with delays and stuff, but even then, it's insane. Synchro Storm is probably the least hype for me, but I am a little bit excited about opening it. It does have a ghost share and some stuff like that. I know it's actually a decent set, which is good too, because sometimes you get a set and it stinks and it's no fun. So it's at least a decent set. Next week with Burst of Destiny is going to be wild. That set is so hyped up. It's, there's some absolute fire cards in it. So hopefully we will get some of those. We got a Watt Key. Worm Galaxy, I don't know, <laughs> Kai Geki. Also, I hope that we can do a stream for Synchro Storm this weekend. I do have to leave on Friday, so if we don't have time, I'll do it next week on like Monday probably. And then we can do a Dawn of Majesty one next weekend, which is going to be pretty crazy. Uh, Dawn of Majesty, what is it called? Not Dawn of Majesty, I, I probably said that earlier. But I keep calling, what is that set called? Um... What is that set called that comes out next week? The good one. I, didn't I just say it or did I say Dawn of Majesty? For some reason, I always call it Dawn of Majesty. I know it's not the same set, but for some reason, my brain doesn't know that. I, what is that set called? Why can't I remember? <laughs> the Okay, the Shein Smoke set. You know, I really honestly cannot remember what that set is called. Whatever it is, Burst of Destiny. There we go. Why, why do I get that confused? They're not even close to the same. I don't know. Burst of Destiny next week is going to be crazy. Live stream. We don't have 10 cases this time, but we will have several cases to open up, which is going to be fun. All right, we got the God of Damarung. We got the Mimir. And the Overpowering Eye, Zero Force, and Legendary Six Samurai Shenang. So far, we've got one Ultra and two Supers, so nothing real crazy here. We would love to pull a Max C. We would love to pull a Ghost Rare. That would be fantastic. An Ultimate Rare would be nice, please. Cash Cash. We got the... What is up with these names? Zvartolf? Zvartolf? I feel like I'm close there. Zvartolf. Very difficult one to pronounce, as usual, with every single card in this set for some reason. Let's keep going. Zvartolf is, uh, has been here. Now let's see if we can pull something I can pronounce, and that's nice. Token Sunday. Watt Mole. Okay, I thought that was a foil. March toward Ragnarok, Triple Impact, and Resonator Engine. Eventually, we're going to pull a an Odin Ghost, right? I mean... I've opened hundreds and hundreds of this pack. Blackwing, Yaksha, Worm King again. Okay, all right. To be fair, these uh, special editions are known for repeats because, as I said, no ratios. You can pull the same thing over and over. Like when we pulled two Max C for Josh. That was pretty cool. Two Max C. I take one Max C and a Ghost. How about that? I'm bargaining. I'll bargain with you. All right. Come on, Jabba. Give us what we want. Oh, the Ruxin special into the Watt Hydra, which is in every single Storm of Ragnarok opening. Watt Hydra super rare. Somewhat nice. I mean, I wouldn't say very nice. I mean, it's not very nice, but it's somewhat nice. Nordic Relic. We have pulled a lot of the same cards so far in terms of the commons. Let's see if we can pull something big. Here we go. Worm Jettle. Garmer. Token Sunday. Symphonic Warrior Drums. Oh, yeah. The old drums, the Symphonic Warriors. Ah, the good old Symphonic Warriors. Love to see those guys. You're trying to pull something good, you pull a set of drums. It's fantastic. <laughs> okay. Let's see what we can do. Tyrant's Tirade. We got the Shin Squire. Got a Demarung. Mami. Hope for Escape and Triple Impact. Okay. And Scrap Shark. Still searching. For something epic. So far, we have one ultra rare. That's our only high rarity card. We have a, a few supers, but they're not too high rarity in this set. We got the Nordic Relic. Come here. Because you can pull... I mean, there's the crazy sheep guy. You can pull secrets, ultimates, ghosts, ultra. So at that point, super rares are not that high rarity. Let's see if we can pull any of those other ones besides ultra rare and super rare. And regular rare. Here we go. Got a damn wrong. Blackwing. Bristow. We got the Yaksha. The Karakuri Ninja. Tire, Token Stampede, Divine Relic, and the Shanae. We still have a few packs left here. I'm not losing hope yet. I'm not losing hope. There's a good chance that we can pull something. Probably, maybe. Let's just gotta believe. Just gotta believe. Hourglass of Courage. Top Runner. Kari Curry Cash Cash. I thought that was a super for some reason. Kaigeki again. Okay, this is not looking like the best special edition so far. But all it takes is one pack. One pull. How about an error pack with like five ghosts in it? How about that? Vylon Matter. We got the Shein Squire. Nordic Relic, 
Levatien. Hope for escape. Yeah, I did not say l whatever that was correctly. <sighs> Come on, guys. We need some luck here. Okay, we finally got it open. It took 10 minutes, but we got it open. We are now less than 2,000 subs away from 100,000, by the way, and we will be doing an epic live stream to get there. Blackwing Bristow. So hopefully that will be at the same time as the next week's stream. We will see. But we are very close. Very close to 100,000. We'll be opening Retro Pack 2 at 100,000 and more other things as well. Blackwing. We got the Yaksha. Karakuri Ninja. Vylon Matter. And Masakani Magatama. Yeah, I nailed that for sure. Cosmic Compass. Wow, these are... This is one of the worst special editions I've ever opened, by the way. <laughs> wow, this is just bad luck. I mean, that, that's part of it, though. When you have no ratios and it's exciting, sometimes you get the bad side of it. That's just how it works. Vylon Matter. Shen Squire. But once again, thanks to Yu-Gi-Oh! Rookie for sending this. Go check him out, guys. Because he has been sending us some really cool stuff. He sent us Generation Force. He sent us Storm of Ragnar. Pretty sure he sent us something... Oh, and then Metal Raiders the first time. That was probably the most fun I've had. The 24 Metal Raiders packs was awesome. Oh, the Rucks and Special. Into the third Worm King. Awesome. Third Worm King. Just what we're looking for. Worm King. Watch this be like a $10 super rare. Sometimes that happens. I'm like, ugh, this card again. And then it's like $10. I'm like, oh, that's pretty good. We still have a few packs left. It's not over, guys. It's not over. Let's go straight from the bottom. Let's try that. Still, though, looking for one. We have one Ultra Rare. That's our high rarity card. Tyree, we got the top runner. Watki and the Scrap Worm. Okay, Blackwing Kalima the Haze. Kagamusha of the Six Samurai. All right, well, maybe it's saving it all for the end. Maybe that's what the deal is here. We got the Worm, Jettelips Kipski. Okay, the Token Sunday. There's one that'll change it all. Max C, a secret rare. It's still banned. But for some reason, it's still expensive because people are just waiting for this to come back. It's at three in the OCG. So maybe one day it'll come back to at least one and, uh, you know, then be crazy valuable. That's a pretty cool pull. All right. That makes the whole special edition worth it. That's a pretty nice. I think it's around 45 bucks. Definitely a nice one. I've not pulled a, a Max C since I pulled Josh those two like a year and a half ago or something. So, uh, Josh, I know that you are watching. So you can uh, remind us of all the good pulls you had. Vylon Matter. We got the Shin Squire. Nordic Relic. Oh, and an ultimate rare! Glipnir, the Feathers of the Fenrir. The Feathers of Fenrir, not Feathers. So this is not the best ultimate rare, but it's an ultimate rare. We had one ultra before the last two packs, now we have a secret and an ultimate. I'm taking that. That's pretty good. I feel like I've pulled that ultimate rare, like, every time. That's, like, the only ultimate rare I can pull. But it's an ultimate rare, so we are not complaining, especially after how bad this started. Okay. So this definitely took a turn for the better. That's nice. All right, and as I said, no ratios. Maybe we could pull something else good. Tyrade, we get the Shin Squire. Got a Demerone. Symphonic Warrior, Piano. The Piano. It's got two A's in Piano. Two more packs. Let's go. Can we get... So we've gotten a secret ultimate. We just need a Ghost Rare. One day, we will make it happen. We will pull the Ghost Rare. Will it be today? We have the Garmer. Mazuho. Oh, the Ruxin Special. It's so hard not to Ruxin Special this set because they warp like crazy when there's an actual foil in here. So we've got the Vortex, the Whirlwind. Very cool. We got a Shin Smoke Signal Barrier Resonator. Final pack of the opening. Thanks again, Yu Gi Oh! Rookie, for sending this in. We've had some pretty good pulls. Can we end it here with something crazy? Squire. Let's not Ruxin Special. Got it, Emma. Oh, and a secret rare Nordic relic, Mejingjord. I don't know if I said that correctly, but it's another secret rare. We will take that. What a way to end. What a way to end. That was a ton of fun. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic openings. Make sure to check out Yu-Gi-Oh! Rookie. Shout out to TCG, Trusted Cards, Toe and Fo Show, Tomato Juice, Stanley, Mike, Nancy, and Mimic Gecko. I appreciate you guys supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.